London Street will be able to harvest kinetic energy. A street just off London's West End has been transformed into the world's first smart street. London's Bird Street has been equipped with a stretch of electricity generating floor tiles and a bench that can filter air. Small energy storing flywheels are equipped inside the tiles. As footsteps land on the tiles, the weight creates a downward force that spins the flywheel, which then converts kinetic energy into electrical energy through electromagnetic induction. Each tile can convert footsteps into 5 watts of electricity. The electricity can then be used to power street lamps, speakers, and Bluetooth transmitters. The clean air bench at one end of the street, besides providing a resting area for pedestrians, filters gases such as nitrogen dioxide and other particles. It then expels the air that has been cleaned. The same electricity generating tiles are also installed at Heathrow Airport and at football pitches in Brazil and Nigeria. Say no to safe spaces on YouTube. Support Tomo News at patreon.com slash Tomo News. An increasing number of cities and streets are getting smarter. San Diego could become the smartest city in the U.S. San Diego is partnering with General Electric to upgrade the city's streetlights into a digital network that can optimize traffic and enhance public safety. More than 3,000 streetlights in San Diego will be equipped with real-time anonymous sensors, cameras, and microphones. The streetlights will be connected to form an IoT network. The streetlights can measure air quality, locate vacant parking spaces, monitor traffic flow of vehicles and pedestrians, as well as detect gun violence. The city will also replace 14,000 streetlights with technology that allows them to dim or brighten manually or automatically, according to natural light conditions. The installation will begin this summer, with the potential for 3,000 more sensors to be added in the future. Solar Roadway Installation Unveiled in Idaho a startup company that has developed solar-powered road panels has recently finished its first public installation in the city of Sandpoint, Idaho. The solar road panels contain LED lights and are made of tempered glass strong enough to support the weight of semi-trailers. The panels are equipped with microprocessors, which allow them to communicate with each other, a control station, and vehicles. The first public installation in Sandpoint uses just 30 panels, which people would walk or ride bikes over. The installation can power a nearby restroom and a fountain. It is equipped with heating elements so it can still operate in the winter. In the future, the solar panels could be used to build highways. Its LED lights can create bright lines and signage without the use of paint. The bright LED lines could also improve nighttime driving conditions. It is reported that the Missouri Department of Transportation intends to install 20 by 12 foot panels to cover sidewalks at rest areas off Route 66 in a trial phase. Israeli company wants to build electric roads that can charge buses and cars. Imagine if you could charge your electric car or bus simply by driving. That is the vision of Israeli company Electrode. Electrode has designed a system that charges electric vehicles by embedding energy transfer coils in the road. As a vehicle such as a bus travels over the coils, its battery is charged wirelessly. Electrode claims it can lay two kilometers of energy transfer coils in a day. Road is dug up by one machine. The coils are laid. Then another machine buries the coils under bitumen. Roadside equipment helps to monitor electricity usage. Electrode hopes to begin testing the system with a public bus in Tel Aviv. Say no to safe spaces on YouTube. Support Tomo News at patreon.com slash Tomo News. Solar-powered roads could power the entire U.S. Idaho-based Solar Roadways is hoping to build solar-powered roads that will not only provide power, but will also create digital driving services that can be remotely controlled. Solar Roadways says if installed nationwide in the U.S., their roads could provide more renewable energy than the entire energy the country uses. Solar-powered roads by Solar Roadways are comprised of hexagonally shaped panels that consist of four layers, a base layer of recyclable materials that is placed on the ground. 
a support structure with embedded circuitry, LED lights that collect sunlight and convert it into electricity, and finally a top layer of reinforced glass with traction support for vehicles. The panels can support trucks weighing up to 250,000 pounds or 115,000 kilograms and the lights can be remotely controlled to provide guidance to drivers or to reallocate spaces in a parking lot. Electric vehicles will be able to use mutual induction technology to charge while driving. The panels also contain heating elements connected to the electricity grid that can melt snow and ice that forms on them. An attached cable corridor helps store and treat stormwater while also providing a place to store power and data cables. The cost of the solar panels can be covered primarily through the generation of electricity, which can also power connected homes and businesses. Solar Roadways estimates there is about 31,000 square miles or 80,000 square kilometers of usable road surfaces in the US that could be converted into solar powered roads. Solar Roadways received a contract from the Federal Highway Administration to build the prototype in 2009. Now they are hoping for $1 million in funding in order to begin mass production of the road.